Good morning, Kettle Run. Today is Thursday, October 20th. I'm Katherine Sheffer. The library will be closed after school today. Tomorrow is the last day to buy a pulsera. See a Spanish teacher or member of the Spanish Honor Society to purchase one. New York field trip forms are available now for DECA and FBLA members. Collection will begin on Wednesday, October 26th at 7 a.m. Only the first 50 students signed up will attend. See a business teacher for details. Now for Club News and Sports with Chris Dodson. Thanks, Catherine. There will be horse judging practice after school today. Psychology Club will meet after school in room 281. There's a DECA and FBLA meeting on Tuesday after school in room 435. Bring candy for trunk or treat. Come out this Saturday and support your cheerleaders as they compete for conference title and the chance to move on to regionals. Competition starts at 6 p.m. Over the next two days, we will show you two stop-motion animation pictures created by Miss Norton's film class. We need your help in deciding which piece will represent our school at the Virginia Film Festival. Yesterday you saw Legos. Today you will see Harambe. After watching them both, tweet us your favorite at KLHS underscore newspaper. Have a great day. We leave you with a look at the birthdays, the lunch menu, and the Harambe video. This is the full story of the legendary Harambe and the legacy he left behind. Throughout his life, he was always protective and loyal to his fellow primates, including humans. He was playful, loving, caring and kind. Everybody loved Harambe. Harambe was a bro. He always made people laugh, and the animals too. He was really a cool guy, really was. I would tell you he's a terrible being, but I'd be lying. May 28th, 2016. It was just a normal day. Actually, the day after his birthday, Wombo was with his buddies hanging out in his favorite tree. Off in the distance, Harambe sports an irresponsible mother, letting her child go into the river. Quickly, Harambe realized he was going to have to save this child. So Harambe runs and catches the child heroically. At this point, Harambe felt he must protect this child from getting into any more danger. So he carried the child to a safe place. Little did he know, he would soon be staring down the barrel of a gun. He never knew that the people that took care of him would soon kill him. It was the short and around the world. Horombe will leave a legacy that will never die, and the zookeepers will soon see this. Riots started forming for Horombe after his death. People wanted justice for Horombe after he was killed in cold blood. The identity of the zookeeper that shot Horombe has been hidden because the people now wanted revenge. I felt killing Harambe was my only option. The public be eventually became less angry and saw Harambe as more of a legend and a fallen Andrew that will live in everyone's hearts forever. Long live Harambe within our hearts, within our souls, within our minds.
forgotten Yeah, I think about him every day Why'd he have to fly away Come but not forgotten He's an angel and he's on his way Rest in paradise, run